Today I'll be showing you how to do no slides on After Effects, so without any jibba jabba, let's get on with it. Nulls are usually used for smoother and more flowy transitions. Let me know down below if you want me to do a whole other video on smooth and flowy transitions. First, import your pictures and resize it to the composition. It doesn't matter, you can even have a landscape or horizontal composition. Pre-compose it, make sure that these two are clicked. Import your two other pictures, resize them and pre-compose them to the composition. Let's say the beat is here and here. Align them so that they overlap a few frames before the beat comes, like this. Go to the topmost layer, add a new null layer. Select the three pictures and parent it to the null. Leave the first clip as it is, go to the second clip, press P on your keyboard and depending on whether you want the null slide to be vertical or horizontal, for the time being I'll be doing horizontal, increase the X position so that this line lies right on the border of the composition. Now, easy tip is, all you need to do is increase the X position, same as the width of your composition and it will be perfect. Go to the third clip, again, the breadth of your composition plus another breadth of your composition because this one should come after the second one. So 1080 plus 1080 equals to 2160 and we're gonna do just that. Go to the null where the second clip starts, press P on your keyboard, stopwatch and go to a few seconds after the beat drops and change the X position so that you can see the second clip fully. Now, while using nulls, it is so important to use mid graphs because then otherwise your transition will look very choppy and you don't want that. Select the keyframes, F9, easy ease them. Select one of the keyframes, go to graphs and follow my graph. Usually while doing mid graphs, make sure you're on the speed graph. It is way easier to control a speed control a speed graph while doing mid graphs. Adjust the knob so that the so that the curve of your graph lies on the beat. Now because there are three images in total we are gonna have to add another null. So do that and parent this first null to the second null. In the end, your transition will look something like this. Thank you for watching, we're done.